In the name of Allah, the entirely merciful, the especially merciful. This is a surah which we have sent down and made that within it obligatory and revealed therein verses of clear evidence that you might remember. The unmarried woman or unmarried man found guilty of sexual intercourse. Lash each one of them with a hundred lashes, and do not be taken by pity for them in the religion of Allah, if you should believe in Allah and the last day, and let a group of the believers witness their punishment. The fornicator does not marry except a female fornicator or polytheist and none marries her except a fornicator or a polytheist, and marriage to such persons has been made unlawful to the believers. فَجْلِدُوهُمْ ثَمَانِينَ جَلْدَةً وَلَا تَقْبَلُوا لَهُمْ شَهَادَةً أَبَدًا وَأُولَئِكَ هُمُ الْفَاسِقُونَ And those who accuse chaste women and then do not produce four witnesses, lash them with eighty lashes and do not accept from them testimony ever after. And those are the defiantly disobedient. Except for those who repent thereafter and reform, for indeed Allah is forgiving and merciful. وَالَّذِينَ يَرْمُونَ أَزْوَاجَهُمْ وَلَمْ يَكُنْ لَهُمْ شُهَدَاءُ إِلَّا أَنفُسُهُمْ فَشَهَادَةُ أَحَدِهِمْ فَشَهَادَةُ أَحَدِهِمْ أَرْبَعُ شَهَادَاتٍ بِاللَّهِ إِنَّهُ لَمِنَ الصَّادِقِينَ and those who accuse their wives of adultery and have no witnesses except themselves, then the witness of one of them shall be four testimonies swearing by Allah that indeed he is of the truthful. <laughs> And the fifth oath will be that the curse of Allah be upon him if he should be among the liars. But it will prevent punishment from her if she gives four testimonies swearing by Allah that indeed he is of the liars. 
والخامسة أن غضب الله عليها إن كان من الصادقين. And the fifth oath will be that the wrath of Allah be upon her if he was of the truthful. وَلَوْلَا فَضْلُ اللَّهِ عَلَيْكُمْ وَرَحْمَتُهُ وَأَنَّ اللَّهَ تَوَّابٌ حَكِيمٌ And if not for the favor of Allah upon you and His mercy, and because Allah is accepting of repentance and wise, إِنَّ الَّذِينَ جَاءُوا بِالْإِفْكِ عُصْبَةٌ مِّنْ Indeed, those who came with falsehood are a group among you. Do not think it bad for you, rather it is good for you. For every person among them is what punishment he has earned from the sin, and he who took upon himself the greater portion thereof, for him is a great punishment. وقالوا هذا إفكم مبين. Why, when you heard it, did not the believing men and believing women think good of themselves and say, This is an obvious falsehood? لولا جاءوا عليه بأربعة شهداء فَإِذْ لَمْ يَأْتُوا بِالشُّهَدَاءِ فَأُولَٰئِكَ عِنْدَ اللَّهِ هُمُ الْكَاذِبُونَ Why did they who slandered not produce for it four witnesses? And when they do not produce the witnesses, then it is they in the sight of Allah who are the liars. وَلَوْلَا فَضْلُ اللَّهِ عَلَيْكُمْ وَرَحْمَتُهُ فِي الدُّنْيَا وَالْآخِرَةِ لَمَسَّكُمْ لَمَسَّكُمْ فِي مَا أَفَضْتُمْ فِيهِ عَذَابٌ عَظِيمٌ And if it had not been for the favor of Allah upon you and His mercy in this world and the hereafter, you would have been touched for that lie in which you were involved by a great punishment. إذ تلقونه بألسنتكم وتقولون بأفواهكم ما ليس لكم به علم وتقولون بأفواهكم ما ليس لكم به علم وتحسبونه هينا وتحسبونه هينا وهو عند الله عظيم. When you received it with your tongues and said with your mouths that of which you had no knowledge and thought it was insignificant while it was in the sight of Allah tremendous. ولولا إذ سمعتموه قلتم ما يكون لنا أن نتكلم بهذا سبحانك سبحانك هذا بهتان عظيم. And why, when you heard it, did you not say, It is not for us to speak of this. Exalted are you, O Allah. This is a great slander. يَعِظُكُمُ اللَّهُ أَن تَعُودُوا لِمِثْلِهِ أَبَدًا إِن كُنتُم مُؤْمِنِينَ Allah warns you against returning to the likes of this conduct ever if you should be believers. وَيُبَيِّنُ اللَّهُ لَكُمُ الْآيَاتِ وَاللَّهُ عَلِيمٌ حَكِيمٌ And Allah makes clear to you the verses, and Allah is knowing and wise.
Indeed, those who like that immorality should be spread among those who have believed will have a painful punishment in this world and the hereafter. And Allah knows, and you do not know. وَلَوْلَا فَضْلُ اللَّهِ عَلَيْكُمْ وَرَحْمَتُهُ وَأَنَّ اللَّهَ رَؤُوفٌ رَحِيمٌ And if it had not been for the favor of Allah upon you and His mercy, and because Allah is kind and merciful, يَا أَيُّهَا الَّذِينَ آمَنُوا لَا تَتَّبِعُوا خُطُوَاتِ الشَّيْطَانِ وَمَنْ يَتَّبِعْ خُطُوَاتِ الشَّيْطَانِ فَإِنَّهُ يَأْمُرُ بِالْفَحْشَاءِ وَالْمُنْكَرِ وَلَوْلَا فَضْلُ اللَّهِ عَلَيْكُمْ وَرَحْمَتُهُ مَا زَكَى مِنْكُمْ مِنْ أَحَدٍ أَبَدًا مَا زَكَى مِنْكُمْ مِنْ أَحَدٍ أَبَدًا وَلَكِنَّ اللَّهَ يُزَكِّي مَنْ يَشَاءُ وَاللَّهُ سَمِيعٌ عَلِيمٌ O you who have believed, do not follow the footsteps of Satan. And whoever follows the footsteps of Satan, indeed, he enjoins immorality and wrongdoing. And if not for the favor of Allah upon you and His mercy, not one of you would have been pure ever. But Allah purifies whom He wills, and Allah is hearing and knowing. وَلَا يَأْتَ لِأُولُو الْفَضْلِ مِنْكُمْ وَالسَّعَةِ أَنْ يُؤْتُوا أُولِي الْقُرْبَى وَالْمَسَاكِينَ وَالْمُهَاجِرِينَ فِي سَبِيلِ اللَّهِ وَلْيَعْفُوا وَلْيَصْفَحُوا أَلَا تُحِبُّونَ أَنْ يَغْفِرَ اللَّهُ لَكُمْ وَاللَّهُ غَفُورٌ رَّحِيمٌ And let not those of virtue among you and wealth swear not to give aid to their relatives and the needy and the immigrants for the cause of Allah, and let them pardon and overlook. Would you not like that Allah should forgive you? And Allah is forgiving and merciful. إِنَّ الَّذِينَ يَرْمُونَ الْمُحْصَنَاتِ الْغَافِلَاتِ الْمُؤْمِنَاتِ لُعِنُوا لُعِنُوا فِي الدُّنْيَا وَالْآخِرَةِ وَلَهُمْ عَذَابٌ عَظِيمٌ Indeed, those who falsely accuse chaste, unaware, and believing women are cursed in this world and the hereafter, and they will have a great punishment. يَوْمَ تَشْهَدُ عَلَيْهِمْ أَلْسِنَتُهُمْ وَأَيْدِيهِمْ وَأَرْجُلُهُمْ بِمَا كَانُوا يَعْمَلُونَ On a day when their tongues, their hands, and their feet will bear witness against them as to what they used to do. يَوْمَ إِذِي يُوَفِّيهِمُ اللَّهُ دِينَهُمُ الْحَقَّ وَيَعْلَمُونَ وَيَعْلَمُونَ أَنَّ اللَّهَ هُوَ الْحَقُّ الْمُبِينَ That day, Allah will pay them in full their true recompense, and they will know that it is Allah who is the manifest truth. الخبيثات للخبيثين والخبيثون للخبيثات والطيبات للطيبين والطيبون للطيبات أولئك مبرؤون مما يقولون لهم مغفرة ورزق كريم Evil words are for evil men. 
and evil men are subjected to evil words, and good words are for good men, and good men are an object of good words. Those good people are declared innocent of what the slanderers say. For them is forgiveness and noble provision. Ya ayyuhal ladhina amanu la tadkhulu buyutan ghayra buyutikum hatta tasta'nisu wa tusallimu ala ahliha thalikum khayrun lakum la'allakum tadhakkarun O you who have believed do not enter houses other than your own houses until you ascertain welcome and greet their inhabitants. That is best for you. Perhaps you will be reminded. And if you do not find anyone therein, do not enter them until permission has been given you. And if it is said to you, go back, then go back. It is purer for you. And Allah is knowing of what you do. ليس عليكم جناح أن تدخلوا بيوتا غير مسكونة فيها متاع لكم والله يعلم ما تبدون وما تكتمون. There is no blame upon you for entering houses not inhabited in which there is convenience for you, and Allah knows what you reveal and what you conceal. قل للمؤمنين يغضوا من أبصارهم ويحفظوا فروجهم ذلك أزكى لهم إن الله خبير بما يصنعون. Tell the believing men to reduce some of their vision and guard their private parts. That is purer for them. Indeed, Allah is acquainted with what they do. وَقُلْ لِلْمُؤْمِنَاتِ يَغْضُضْنَ مِنْ أَبْصَارِهِنَّ وَيَحْفَظْنَ فُرُوجَهُنَّ وَلَا يُبْدِينَ زِينَتَهُنَّ إِلَّا مَا ظَهَرَ مِنْهَا وَلْيَضْرِبْنَ بِخُمُرِهِنَّ عَلَى جُيُوبِهِنَّ وَلَا يُبْدِينَ زِينَتَهُنَّ إِلَّا لِبُعُولَتِهِنَّ أو آبائهن أو آباء بعولتهن أو أبنائهن أو أبنائهن أو أبناء بعولتهن أو إخوانهن أو إخوانهن أو بني إخوانهن أو بني أخواتهن أو نسائهن أو نسائهن أو ما ملكت أيمانهن أو التابعين أو التابعين غير أولي الإربة من الرجال أو الطفل الذين لم يظهروا على عورات النساء ولا يضربن بأرجلهن ليعلم ما يخفين من زينتهن وتوبوا إلى الله جميعا أيها المؤمنون لعلكم تفلحون. And tell the believing women to reduce some of their vision and guard their private parts and not expose their adornment except that which appears thereof and to draw their head covers over their chests and not display their adornment except to their husbands, their fathers, their husbands' fathers their sons, their husband's sons, their brothers, their brother's sons, their sister's sons, their women, that which their right hands possess, or those male attendants having no physical desire, 
or children who are not yet aware of the private aspects of women. And let them not stamp their feet to make known what they conceal of their adornment. And turn to Allah in repentance, all of you, O believers, that you might succeed. وَأَنْكِحُوا الْأَيَامَا مِنْكُمْ وَالصَّالِحِينَ مِنْ عِبَادِكُمْ وَإِمَائِكُمْ إِنْ يَكُونُوا فُقَرَاءَ يُغْنِهِمُ اللَّهُ مِنْ فَضْلِهِ وَاللَّهُ وَاسِعٌ عَلِيمٌ And marry the unmarried among you, and the righteous among your male slaves and female slaves. If they should be poor, Allah will enrich them from His bounty, and Allah is all-encompassing and knowing. وَلْيَسْتَعْفِفِ الَّذِينَ لَا يَجِدُونَ نِكَاحًا حَتَّى يُغْنِيَهُمُ اللَّهُ مِنْ فَضْلِهِ وَالَّذِينَ يَبْتَغُونَ الْكِتَابَ مِمَّا مَلَكَتْ أَيْمَانُكُمْ فَكَاتِبُوهُمْ إِنْ عَلِمْتُمْ فِيهِمْ خَيْرًا وَآتُوهُمْ مِمَّا لِلَّهِ الَّذِي آتَاكُمْ وَلَا تُكْرِهُوا فَتَيَاتِكُمْ عَلَى الْبِغَاءِ إِنْ أَرَدْنَ تَحَصُّنًا لِتَبْتَغُوا عَرَضَ الْحَيَاةِ الدُّنْيَا وَمَنْ يُكْرِهُنَّ فَإِنَّ اللَّهَ مِنْ بَعْدِ إِكْرَاهِهِنَّ غَفُورٌ رَحِيمٌ But let them who find not the means for marriage abstain from sexual relations until Allah enriches them from His bounty. And those who seek a contract for eventual emancipation from among whom your right hands possess, then make a contract with them if you know there is within them goodness, and give them from the wealth of Allah which He has given you. And do not compel your slave girls to prostitution if they desire chastity, to seek thereby the temporary interests of worldly life. And if someone should compel them, then indeed Allah is to them, after their compulsion, forgiving and merciful. وَلَقَدْ أَنزَلْنَا إِلَيْكُمْ آيَاتٍ مُبَيِّنَاتٍ وَمَثَلًا ومثلا من الذين خلوا من قبلكم وموعظة للمتقين. And we have certainly sent down to you distinct verses and examples from those who passed on before you and an admonition for those who fear Allah. Allah نور السماوات والأرض. مثل نوره كمشكاة فيها مصباح المصباح في زجاجة الزجاجة كأنها كوكب دري يوقد من شجرة مباركة يوقد من شجرة مباركة زيتونة لا شرقية ولا غربية يكاد زيتها يضيء يكاد زيتها يضيء ولو لم تمسسه نار نور على نور يَهْدِ اللَّهُ لِنُورِهِ مَنْ يَشَاءُ وَيَضْرِبُ اللَّهُ الْأَمْثَالَ لِلنَّاسِ وَاللَّهُ بِكُلِّ شَيْءٍ عَلِيمٌ Allah is the light of the heavens and the earth. The example of His light is like a niche within which is a lamp. The lamp is within glass. The glass as if it were a pearly white star lit from the oil of a blessed olive tree, neither of the east nor of the west, whose oil would almost glow even if untouched by fire. Light upon light, Allah guides to his light whom he wills, and Allah presents examples for the people, and Allah is knowing of all things. 
فی بیوت اذن الله ان ترفع ويذكر فيها اسمه يسبح له فيها يسبح له فيها بالغدو والآصال Such niches are in mosques which Allah has ordered to be raised and that his name be praised therein exalting him within them in the morning and the evenings رجال لا تلهيهم تجارة ولا بيع عن ذكر الله وإقام الصلاة وإقام الصلاة وإيتاء الزكاة يخافون يوما يخافون يوما تتقلب فيه القلوب والأبصار Are men whom neither commerce nor sale distracts from the remembrance of Allah and performance of prayer and giving of zakah. They fear a day in which the hearts and eyes will fearfully turn about. ليجزيهم الله أحسن ما عملوا ويزيدهم من فضله والله يرزق من يشاء بغير حساب That Allah may reward them according to the best of what they did and increase them from his bounty and Allah gives provision to whom he wills without limit وَالَّذِينَ كَفَرُوا أَعْمَالُهُمْ كَسَرَابٍ بِقِيعَةٍ يَحْسَبُهُ الظَّمْآنُ مَاءً يَحْسَبُهُ الظَّمْآنُ مَاءً حَتَّى إِذَا جَاءَهُ لَمْ يَجِدْهُ شَيْئًا حتى إذا جاءه لم يجده شيئا ووجد الله عنده فوفاه حسابه والله سريع الحساب But those who disbelieved, their deeds are like a mirage in a low land which a thirsty one thinks is water until when he comes to it, he finds it is nothing but finds Allah before him, and he will pay him in full his due, and Allah is swift in account. أو كظلمات في بحر اللجي يغشاه موج من فوقه موج من فوقه سحاب ظلمات بعضها فوق بعض إذا أخرج يده لم يكد يراها ومن لم يجعل الله له نورا فما له من نور Or they are like darknesses within an unfathomable sea which is covered by waves upon which are waves over which are clouds darknesses, some of them upon others. When one puts out his hand therein, he can hardly see it. And he to whom Allah has not granted light, for him there is no light. أَلَمْ تَرَ أَنَّ اللَّهَ يُسَبِّحُ لَهُ مَنْ فِي السَّمَاوَاتِ وَالْأَرْضِ وَالطَّيْرُ صَافَّاتِ قد علم صلاته وتسبيحه والله عليم بما يفعلون. Do you not see that Allah is exalted by whomever is within the heavens and the earth and by the birds with wings spread in flight? Each of them has known his means of prayer and exalting him, and Allah is knowing of what they do. وَلِلَّهِ مُلْكُ السَّمَاوَاتِ وَالْأَرْضِ وَإِلَى اللَّهِ الْمَصِيرِ And to Allah belongs the dominion of the heavens and the earth, and to Allah is the destination. أَلَمْ تَرَ 
Do you not see that Allah drives clouds? Then He brings them together, then He makes them into a mass, and you see the rain emerge from within it. And He sends down from the sky mountains of clouds within which is hail, and He strikes with it whom He wills, and averts it from whom He wills. The flash of its lightning almost takes away the eyesight. Allah alternates the night and the day. Indeed, in that is a lesson for those who have vision. وَاللَّهُ خَلَقَ كُلَّ دَابَّةٍ مِّن مَّا فَمِنْهُمْ مَنْ يَمْشِي عَلَى بَطْنِهِ وَمِنْهُمْ مَنْ يَمْشِي عَلَى رِجْلَيْنِ وَمِنْهُمْ مَنْ يَمْشِي عَلَى أَرْبَعْ Allah has created every living creature from water, and of them are those that move on their bellies, and of them are those that walk on two legs, and of them are those that walk on four. Allah creates what He wills. Indeed, Allah is over all things competent. لَقَدْ أَنزَلْنَا آيَاتٍ مُبَيِّنَاتٍ وَاللَّهُ يَهْدِي مَنْ يَشَاءُ إِلَى صِرَاطٍ مُسْتَقِيمٍ We have certainly sent down distinct verses. And Allah guides whom He wills to a straight path. But the hypocrites say, We have believed in Allah and in the Messenger, and we obey. Then a party of them turns away after that, and those are not believers. <laughs> And when they are called to the words of Allah and His Messenger to judge between them, at once a party of them turns aside in refusal. But if the right is theirs, they come to Him in prompt obedience. Is there disease in their hearts? Or have they doubted? Or do they fear that Allah will be unjust to them or His Messenger? Rather, it is they who are the unjust. 
انما كان قول المؤمنين اذا دعوا الى الله ورسوله ليحكم بينهم ان يقولوا ان يقولوا سمعنا واطعنا واولئك هم المفلحون The only statement of the true believers when they are called to Allah and his messenger to judge between them is that they say we hear and we obey and those are the successful ومن يطع الله ورسوله ويخشى الله ويتقه فاولئك هم الفائزون And whoever obeys Allah and his messenger and fears Allah and is conscious of him it is those who are the attainers وَأَقْسَمُوا بِاللَّهِ جَهْدَ أَيْمَانِهِمْ لَإِنْ أَمَرْتَهُمْ لَيَخْرُجُنَّ قُلْ لَا تُقْسِمُوا طَاعَةٌ مَعْرُوفَةٌ إِنَّ اللَّهَ خَبِيرٌ بِمَا تَعْمَلُونَ And they swear by Allah their strongest oaths that if you ordered them, they would go forth in Allah's cause. Say, do not swear, such obedience is known. Indeed, Allah is acquainted with that which you do. قُلْ أَطِيعُوا اللَّهَ وَأَطِيعُوا الرَّسُولِ فَإِن تَوَلَّوْا فَإِنَّمَا عَلَيْهِ مَا حُمِّلَ وَعَلَيْكُمْ مَا حُمِّلَ Say, Obey Allah and obey the Messenger. But if you turn away, then upon him is only that duty with which he has been charged, and upon you is that with which you have been charged. And if you obey him, you will be rightly guided. And there is not upon the messenger except the responsibility for clear notification. وَمَنْ كَفَرَ بَعْدَ ذَلِكَ فَأُولَئِكَ هُمُ الْفَاسِقُونَ Allah has promised those who have believed among you and done righteous deeds that He will surely grant them succession to authority upon the earth just as He granted it to those before them and that He will surely establish for them therein their religion which He has preferred for them and that He will surely establish for them after their fear, security, for they worship me, not associating anything with me. But whoever disbelieves after that, then those are the defiantly disobedient. وَأَقِيمُوا الصَّلَاةَ وَآتُوا الزَّكَاةَ وَأَطِيعُوا الرَّسُولَ لَعَلَّكُمْ تُرْحَمُونَ And establish prayer and give zakah and obey the messenger. That you may receive mercy. لا تحسبن الذين كفروا معجزين في الأرض ومأواهم النار ولا بأس المصير. Never think that the disbelievers are causing failure to Allah upon the earth. Their refuge will be the fire, and how wretched the destination. يا 
ايها الذين امنوا ليستاذنكم الذين ملكت ايمانكم والذين لم يبلغوا الحلم منكم ثلاث مرات من قبل صلاه الفجر وحين تضعون ثيابكم من الظهيره ومن بعد صلاه العشاء ثلاث عورات لكم ليس عليكم ولا عليهم جناح بعدهم طوافون عليكم بعضكم على بعض كذلك يبين الله لكم الايات والله عليم حكيم او you who have believed let those whom your right hands possess and those who have not yet reached puberty among you ask permission of you before entering at three times before the dawn prayer and when you put aside your clothing for rest at noon and after the night prayer These are three times of privacy for you. There is no blame upon you nor upon them beyond these periods, for they habitually circulate among you, some of you among others. Thus does Allah make clear to you the verses, and Allah is knowing and wise. وَإِذَا بَلَغَ الْأَطْفَالُ مِنْكُمُ الْحُلُمَ فَلْيَسْتَأْذِنُوا كَمَا اسْتَأْذَنَ الَّذِينَ مِنْ قَبْلِهِمْ كَذَلِكَ يُبَيِّنُ اللَّهُ لَكُمْ آيَاتِهِ وَاللَّهُ عَلِيمٌ حَكِيمٌ And when the children among you reach puberty, let them ask permission at all times, as those before them have done. Thus does Allah make clear to you his verses and Allah is knowing and wise. Wal qawa'id min an-nisa' illati la yarjuna nikahan falaysa 'alayhin junah falaysa 'alayhin junah ay yad'na thiyabahum غير متبرجات بزينة وأن يستعففن خير لهم والله سميع عليم. And women of postmenstrual age who have no desire for marriage, there is no blame upon them for putting aside their outer garments but not displaying adornment. But to modestly refrain from that is better for them. and Allah is hearing and knowing. لَيْسَ عَلَى الْأَعْمَى حَرَجٌ وَلَا عَلَى الْأَعْرَجِ حَرَجٌ وَلَا عَلَى الْمَرِيضِ حَرَجٌ وَلَا عَلَى أَنفُسِكُمْ وَلَا عَلَى أَنفُسِكُمْ أَن تَأْكُلُوا مِنْ بُيُوتِكُمْ أَوْ بُيُوتِ آبَائِكُمْ أَوْ بُيُوتِ أُمَّهَاتِكُمْ أو بيوت أمهاتكم أو بيوت إخوانكم أو بيوت أخواتكم أو بيوت أعمامكم أو بيوت أعمامكم أو بيوت عماتكم أو بيوت أخوالكم أو بيوت خالاتكم أو بيوت خالاتكم أو ما ملكتم مفاتحه أو صديقكم ليس عليكم جناح أن تأكلوا جميعا أو أشتاتا فإذا دخلتم بيوتا فسلموا على أنفسكم تحية من عند الله تحية من عند الله مباركة طيبة كذلك يبين الله لكم الآيات لعلكم تعقلون. There is not upon the blind any guilt, nor upon the lame any guilt, nor upon the ill any guilt, nor upon yourselves if you eat from your own houses, 
or the houses of your fathers, or the houses of your mothers, or the houses of your brothers, or the houses of your sisters, or the houses of your father's brothers, or the houses of your father's sisters, or the houses of your mother's brothers, or the houses of your mother's sisters, or from houses whose keys you possess, or from the house of your friend. There is no blame upon you whether you eat together or separately. But when you enter houses, give greetings of peace upon each other, a greeting from Allah, blessed and good. Thus does Allah make clear to you the verses of ordinance that you may understand. <laughs> The believers are only those who believe in Allah and His Messenger. And when they are meeting with Him for a matter of common interest, do not depart until they have asked His permission. Indeed, those who ask your permission, O Muhammad, those are the ones who believe in Allah and His Messenger. So when they ask your permission for something of their affairs, then give permission to whom you will among them, and ask forgiveness for them of Allah. Indeed, Allah is forgiving and merciful. لا تجعلوا دعاء الرسول بينكم كدعاء بعضكم بعضا قد يعلم الله الذين يتسللون منكم لواذا فليحذر الذين يخالفون عن أمره أن تصيبهم فتنة أن تصيبهم فتنة أو يصيبهم عذاب أليم. Do not make your calling of the messenger among yourselves as the call of one of you to another. Already Allah knows those of you who slip away, concealed by others. So let those beware who dissent from the Prophet's order, lest fitna strike them or a painful punishment. ألا إن لله ما في السماوات والأرض قد يعلم ما أنتم عليه ويوم يرجعون إليه فينبئهم بما عملوا والله بكل شيء عليم. Unquestionably. To Allah belongs whatever is in the heavens and earth. Already He knows that upon which you stand, and knows the day when they will be returned to Him, and He will inform them of what they have done. And Allah is knowing of all things. <laughs> 